All right, Pinky OTR Diva back in the building. So we just gonna go ahead and jump right into it, Pink. You you're absolutely right, man. I you know yo, I, I you 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 made a post and and you said and quote, why is it that folks can borrow money from you but don't want to pay it back? You said, but these are the same folks who complain to others that owe them. You turn around and say, you said, just because they do you wrong doesn't mean that you have to do the next person the same way. And I'm going to stop right there because I'm sorry, I had to do the next person the same way. I got, I, I got, a, I, I got a text this morning uh, from a from a former driver. They 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 needed some help. They they explained to me that uh, you know they was in a little bind. I, now mind you, OTR, I I haven't heard from this person in over a year. Okay, mm -hmm. I mean you know they 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 came back on social media. And that's how I was able to find them. So they said, okay. uh, you know, you know, I just need a couple of dollars or whatever, whatever, and I'll pay you back. And in the back of my head, I goes, well, if you're not driving the truck, how are you going to pay me back? You know what I'm right. saying? If you if you was driving the truck and you say you're going to pay me back, then I know you're going to pay me back within a week or whatever because you're driving the truck or you're getting into a truck. You know, they didn't bother to say that. But if you're getting into the truck, like, look, I'm I'm going with Snyder. I'm going to rock out with them for about a week. And, you know, they're not going to I'm not going to get paid to the following week. Can you help me out? Yada, 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 yada. Then maybe if possibly if I wasn't in the situation that I'm currently in. Now I learned, uh, you know, oh. as, as I as I I did uh, I I did a live feed of three hour live feed this morning talking about the same thing. Like people will ask you for money, you loan it to them, or you 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 help them out, and then they ghost you. Like, and then they come back, you know, they come back at you like, I know I owe you some money, I owe you a hundred dollars. But can you loan me 50 because, you know, I'm down on my luck and I need some food and this, that and the third. And I'm like, look, man, you already owe me a hundred. And you've been owing me a hundred for almost a year. So you asking me for 50. I was like, look, man, OK, all right, cool. You pulled at the heart strings. I, boom. Now I got a hundred. I got a hundred fifty plus out in the wind. And now I got another person reaching out to me asking me uh can I help them out and I had to I had to I had to re respectfully turn them down because I got money out there diva what 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 happened right. what happened to you to 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 make this post well it wasn't a driver it was somebody else somebody mm -hmm. crazy but it was my daughter's father. Um, he asked me for some money and gave him um, X amount of dollars. And mm -hmm. then um, he was like, I, you know, he was like, I don't know why the dude who saw the bar, my, bar money for me. He already owed me money. I'm like, in my head, I'm like, but you owe me money. <laughs> so then I think the last draw was when he asked me for money. Um, he said he needed for his mom. I've been trying to keep photo of it through my cash app. He was like, you want to take his mom out? And I was like, okay, cool. You know, I help you take, you know, do something nice for your mom. So this is for mother, before Mother's Day. So I gave him the money and come to find out, um, it was like a whole big thing. I found out he'd been talking to this other chick for a whole year on me. And my money that I've been giving him, he's been taking my money and spending it on her. Oh my so God. So I asked for my money back. Right. So I'm here paying me my money back, but then at the same time telling me to pay my money back, told me don't contact them again. And ever since then, he was like, I, I don't know. You know, I don't know about the money. Oh my and God. since then, I have not talked to him. Now, see, like, it's worse. It, it is worse. It is worse when it's 
when it's a family member. It's worse when it's yeah. a family member. It is, it's, it's that crazy that this is your, well, y'all not bound by blood, but y'all, y'all bound by marriage oh. or previous marriage. So you still, obviously you still consider him as family because you, I, I'm sure you wouldn't, uh, you know, cough up the ducats if you didn't. So right. it's, it's hard to imagine your own family member ducking and dodging, you know, mm -hmm. it, it wouldn't hurt so bad if it was somebody else. Cause I could just say, yo, sorry, and our, whatever, whatever. But when it's your own family that you care a little bit about and, and they ducking and dodge you because of money, it's a sad situation, you know? Yeah, because the last time, well, I guess the last time, uh, I think the time before, because it took me, I uh, kind of hesitated to give him the money to his mom a little bit. But the time before, they, I found out when he, he, he asked me for money and he took it and gave it to somebody. Well, I found him out, found out he was out somewhere else. And he was like, I know you're mad at me because you, you know, you, I asked you for money and, and I'm going to give you money back. And I'm just like, you know, it's the principle about it. You know, if you're going to tell me you need, you know, help with the light bill or you need help with, you're short on your light bill, you're short on something that you need. Don't use my money for something you want. Like, you want to take somebody on a date. Now, nah, my money ain't for that. Sorry. Mm, that is if fast. You find another way, another bag to do, to take somebody out. You want to buy them some roses. You know, you got to do that on your own, but not use my hard-earned money. And then, you know, because I started looking at, hey, I'm not your um, ATM machine. I'm not the people of America. So my name doesn't say I'm America. You know, I'm not the people's bank. I'm not the credit union. You know, I'm not those. Now, I work know, hard. I get out here on this road and, and do what I do. Now, you know, it's, it's messed up when you're... Your your own species, your own people. You go back to them, and you be like, "Yo, bro, yo, sis, can I get that hundred dollars back? You you got that hundred dollars for me? You 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 got that two hundred for me? That that one fifty for me? And then they get they mm -hmm. got they got the nerve to get mad. Oh, don't I, I yep. can't I, I can't I, I don't have no money." I don't understand why you keep asking me. I don't have. I don't have it now. But when you asked me, I was there for you, though, bruh. Sis, mm -hmm. I'm not supposed to pinky. We're we're not supposed to feel some kind of way about seeing you flossing, showing back up on social media, looking good, smelling good, feeling good. Talking about mm -hmm. you back, you know, I'm showing that you, yeah, showing that, you know, showing that, showing that ticket. We're not supposed to feel some kind of way, like, bruh, the first pinky, do you agree with me? The first person that they should have called before they even got back on social media was the person that they owe, right? Yeah, I agree. I done seen this person post up on his birthday where he got like thousands of dollars. I'm like, but where am I cut at? <laughs> or or come on or come on social media with the cash out like, yo, today's my birthday. Here's my cash out. Today's my mm -hmm. birthday. Thank you for the cash app. All right, well, bro, today's your birthday. I I figured maybe about a couple of hundred so far. What what about breaking me off something? Like at least at least show uh, a goodwill intent. At least show intent or, that you're going you to give me something. Or, or you hear, oh, I got a bonus in my paycheck. Okay, you got a bonus in your paycheck. So I, I, I guess I get a little fresh too, don't I? <sighs> Man, I, 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 I just don't get it. Like, like I said, you know, it's, it's, un it's unfortunate. It's it's unfortunate that that you gotta you, you know it's a, you gotta cut people off because of what others done previously. 
it's it's like it, it's just like I told her this morning. I was like, look, I'm sorry. I I, I can't ima uh, imagine the situation. Uh, but I mean, my my money's hard to come by. I, you know, I, I, I drive 3000 plus miles and go through a lot of bullshit just to get the, just to get the, the, the settlement that I get at the end of the week. I don't have, I don't have, what's that app? I don't have chime. So I can't get my money on Wednesday. Like the most majority of you guys do. I got a regular bank and it's called chase and that money don't go in until six o'clock Friday morning. Or it, it goes in overnight and I say it will process and I will see it at six o'clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. And when I go in there and take care of what I need to take care of, take care of bills and all like that, I'm not thinking about, okay, uh, this person right here needs something. This person right there needs something. I mean, I, you know, respectfully, I apologize for saying that, but I'm I'm really nice. I'm, I'm 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 sending money to my son to make sure that he's all right. And then after I get finished with all the cuts and bruises, I'm down to like maybe like a hundred dollars for the week. So, you know, if I give you a cut of my hundred dollars, that means that means Friday. Friday, Thursday, and Wednesday, I'm not eating. And then I gotta come back. I gotta come back to you and hound you for, you know, for the money that I that I give you. And, and we we're not here to listen to your excuses because you didn't give us none when you we we didn't give you none when you asked. So it's not fair. It's not fair for you to give us all these excuses. Yada yada yada, this, that, and the third, when we come to ask for our money back. Mm -hmm. Very, very powerful uh post there, Pinky. And I'm I, I was surprised when I seen it. I was like, wait a minute, this is exactly what I was talking about this morning. Let me call this lady up. Yeah, I'm over here, I, I'm over here talking about. Oh. What happens when you get out of the truck and all like that and talk about people owe you some money and all like that? And then here you are posting this. I'm like, oh, hold on me. You gotta talk. <laughs> yeah. So when I say when I say don't do the next person the same way, meaning um uh, like he owe he owe me money, but because somebody owes him money, don't turn around and just just disregard me because somebody owes you money. So you're going to turn around and, and, and do me the same way. You're going to be on me and have me upset. Just pay me. You know, you deal with the other person. I ain't got nothing to do with, with what arrangement y'all do that. But, you know, we have an arrangement. You're supposed to pay me back. You give me my money. You're right. like, you want your money right. from your friend? You go to your friend and ask for the, for, the, for the money back. Right. Exactly. <laughs> And 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 again, like I said, money, you know, they say money is the root of all evil. But when it comes to a friendship or family and money is in the midst and y'all not on the same page with that money, then, yeah, it's going to present a problem, bro. It's going to present a huge, yeah. huge problem. You know, I was talking about it. I was talking about it this morning. Somebody hit the lottery. Somebody hit my Ohio lottery. Let's just say that. Right. <laughs> You got ten thousand dollars. You coming on social media? You taking the picture with the with the lottery commission? And here I am over here, like, yo, you owe me a hundred fifty. I'm like, oh, okay, it's time. Now you would think, like I said, you 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 would think, but like, hey, bruh, here's your hundred and fifty. But let me double that because of because of the situation and how long it was. Y'all don't even do that. Y'all, y'all don't even do that. Y'all don't even offer, you know, like here, here's an incentive for you know your time or whatever, whatever. You just you you pay the money back with a mean mug, nigga. You just got finished getting up getting ten thousand dollars from the Ohio lottery cheesing, 
And 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 you 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 can't pay a brother back a hundred fifty. What 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 a smile? You mean mugging? Like I did something wrong? How do you pink? How, wow. how how do you feel when when somebody mean mug you and and pay you back and make you feel like you was in the wrong for asking for your money back? How I feel. <laughs> That's how you feel. I mean, you should be me bugging me. I mean, I just want to like, I know next time, you know, if you need something, I don't care what it is. You won't get it from me. See there, you just you 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 just messed up the connection there, bruh. Sis, y'all messed up the connection. Now, yeah. now when y'all need something, I'm still in trucking. I'm doing good in trucking. I'm being successful in trucking. I'm making sure that I keep my credentials clean. My health on point. I'm making sure that I'm still be able to drive this motherfucking truck. Maybe when I'm 80. Well, I'm not trying to go that far, but but I'm just right. saying. <laughs> you know, I'm 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 still yeah. I'm, I'm I'm still driving and everything. But here you is, you're out of the truck for whatever reason. Like, I mean, the 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 person that old that old be the bill fifty, um. Something tragic happened, which she refused to talk about, and I I respect that. You know, I was like, you know, you know, just like I was telling people when I reach out to them, like, yo, it, it don't always have to be on the podcast. You know what I'm saying? You talk to me behind the scenes or whatever, whatever. But you know, you know, if you want to talk to me on the podcast, it'll be good for the next person, just so that they, you know, probably might be in the same shoes as you or whatever. But. For whatever right. for whatever reason, she you know went through a whole bunch of things, and she she got ghosts. The first time she got ghosts with the hundred dollars was that she was in jail. I was like, cool, no problem, I'm good with that. I'm out now. You know, I'm posting on Instagram, showing you pictures. Here I am, chilling with some people. Yada yada yada. And in the back of my head, I'm like, well, okay, you still owe me a hundred dollars. Why you ain't give me a call to just it, it, at least let me know that you're doing all right, right? So after that, right. a- after that, she called me up six, seven, eight, nine, ten months later, and asked me for the fifty. Now that was at the end of last year. It is. Well, you might as well say it's going on fucking June because May's almost done. <laughs> I'm just saying. Hell, I get my right. I get right. my I get my YouTube paycheck next week. That that's how I know that May's halfway done. So you might as well say six months. So a total of damn near two years that you've been, you know, that you owe me a, a bill fifty. But yet I see you come back on social media. Hi, I'm back. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, where you been this time? Oh, well, you know, uh, I'm I'm down and out over here. Yada, yada, yada. See, that goes to tell me or goes to show a lot of people that you spend all your money to get your CDLs. But you don't you 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 don't uh you you don't make it a priority to keep them. What? You got a lot of influencers out here that be telling you to come out here to get the bag and trucking is a you know trucking is a is, is like a disco and shit like that. Come on in and this that and the third. But nobody ain't out there telling you like I said before in the in the chat. Nobody ain't out there telling you the real deal. You get in the accident, boom, you don't have your license. You get sick, boom, you're you're out of the truck. Your family, something happened in your family, and you gotta you, you gotta step back from the truck. Boom, you're out of the truck. You're not making no money. You're not making that grand. You're not making that fifteen hundred. You're not making that no more. Right. So. But yeah, OTR Diva, Pinky, thank you very much. I really appreciate you stepping up in the building once again, as always. How's uh how's Stevens treating you, man? I mean, they they 
they love you over there. <laughs> yeah, they love me. I just went and did uh, a make a wish uh, foundation for Convoy for Mother's Day. I was like standing with the truck, he, um, set up donations for me um, to be able to be in it to make a wish um, foundation um, for Convoy for Mother's Day. How how long and you been? How long how, like, how long you been with Steven so far? Uh, September make four years. Now let me ask you this: With all the accolades that you get in from the company, are the company is giving you a little bit uh, more financially outside of what you're making on the truck? Uh, for me, uh, well, it all depends on what I'm doing because I'm I'm an ambassador, so I do get paid for that. Um, I'm not a bachelor to a contractor, to new contractors that's coming into the company. Mm -hmm. But it's, it's coming over to the contractor side. So I get uh, a pay on that, a little extra pay there. And then I still, I still, I'm still a trainer. I just don't train female. I train, train the guys. So I get extra pay for that. And every now and then they might, you know, throw me something. I ain't gonna say, you know, a dollar figure or whatever, but every now and then, I get a little something extra. Well, that's what's up, man. Trainer, ambassador, owner, operator, mother, trucker. Man, you, 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 you just a jack of all trades over there, OTR Diva. How how old are you? How how, how old are you, OTR Diva? You still you yeah, you yeah, still yeah. you still looking you still looking young and fresh for your age. How old are you? Forty six. Thank you. Look at that. Look at that. Over there trying to do some TikTok dances. <laughs> Go somewhere and sit down. <laughs> Go somewhere and sit down. <laughs> they told me that yesterday on the yard. They were like, do, do a couple on the yard for you need. I'm like, I'll, I'll think about it. <laughs> over there, over there, over there, over there shaking your little bun bun on some TikTok, man. Don't you know that? Don't you know TikTok ain't made for us, man? Go sit down somewhere. But you you looking good over there, driver. So, again, I appreciate you coming on as always. Thank you. Thank you for always being a friend of the show. Uh, you know, and I, I just, you know, much respect. And I, like I said, I'm just I'm just in awe in everything that's that's coming your way. Guys, you know, the best conversation starts here on the Lockout Men podcast show. And if you want to get in on the conversation, get at me, 216-600-2090. We'll make ways for you to get in and chop it up with me. We talk, I talk to everybody, not just truckers. I talk to influencers. I talk to uh, business-minded people. We talk, we get it going here on the Lockout Men podcast show. That is what's up. Don't forget to do me the favor of Hook, not hooking, but the HBO special. That's the help a brother out special by hitting that like button, subscribe button, and that new thank you button for the support of the channel. Until next time, everybody, y'all take it easy.